Hello, I'm Forrest Atman, and today I'm assisted by the lovely Tanya Oos. We're going to be talking about a dance I love very much, the Latin Hustle. So without further ado, let's get into some of the signature moves of the Latin Hustle. Um, one of the first things I want to say is Latin Hustle is not the same as what we do today. A lot of people use uh, the term Latin Hustle, and they mean the evolved form of it, the three count or street hustle, as it was popularly known in the 70s. So the original Latin hustle used a tap base. So you would start with a tap step and then use a triple step. In this case, you usually went behind in the closed base, triple step, and then a together side. So you do a tap step, back and side, side step. If we do it from here, you can see that we'll start with, we'll use a back tap. You have options, you can tap to the side, you can tap back, or if you have space between you, you can tap forward. So from the side, of course, forward, side, back, or sometimes at an angle here as well, okay? So you can kind of tap where you want. But again, if we do it from here so you can see, we're doing tap, step, triple step, 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 or one, two, three, and four, five, six. This is your closed basic. Good, next we're gonna move on from here. Let's go into, from here we have some options on how we can go uh, from this position into breakaway position. So the first ones that we can use is maybe sending her out. So from here, I'll do a tap, step, triple step, step, step. Notice how she's rotating, going into a fan position, away from me, and then coming towards me. Do it from this side now. All right, here we go. And tap, step, back together, forward, step, together. So you can see that she's rotating. I'm not moving much from this line at all. Tap, step, I stay mostly in place, she comes back to me. Now we also have the option to rotate and face towards the follow as we do this motion. Tap, step, triple step, step, step. Again, tap, step, triple step, step, step. I could tap behind though, it's a bit awkward honestly. It helps more to have your body move in opposition to the follower. So this is our basic send out, we send her out. Uh, from closed position to an open position here. Um, this is more comfortable in my position. They're going straight into uh, facing each other and breaking away from closed position, which I'll show you. Once you get her out there, a lot of times, one of the things about modern hustle is that uh, pretty much you're constantly changing places every three counts or so, so it feels very fast. One of the favorite, my favorite things about the Latin hustle is it's slower. It uses a six count basic, okay? So here, if we uh, think about this, I'm gonna go, Tap, step, triple step, step, step. Now once we're here, this is why a lot of dancers thought it felt like West Coast Swing when they first learned it, uh, or Lindy Hop, because here as we're doing a basic, we can do tap, step, triple step, step, step. Again, we can choose how we play with our tap positioning. The big difference between this and uh, push break, as you see in West Coast Swing or Lindy Hop is that the woman is usually doing most of the motion. Here, we're doing symmetric motion. The only other parallel might be a Carolina Shag and go back and forth together. So here, if you notice, tap, step, we both go back together, forward, step, together. One, two, three, and four, five, six. Good, all right. The next thing I'm gonna do is the same exact uh, concept here, except we're gonna do a side basic. Uh, one of my favorite things here is going from here, and what we're going to do is we're just going to turn, uh, changing our angle to move back towards the camera, back together, forward, step, step. So it's going to be rotating, right? So I'll do tap, step, back together, forward, step, step. Good. Again, it's done synchronized. We're going go the same direction. I'm going to change angles here. Do it again, face the camera. We'll do tap, step, triple step, 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 tap, step. Triple step, step, step. Now, if I want to use a vintage styling, notice what my arm circles to do there is encircle the arms, dropping them down in a big circular lead. Signature of hustle. Another thing to do it is if you use a swivel base while doing it, you have a double action happening on it. So you like tap, step, triple step, 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 tap, step, triple step, swivel, swivel, step. Again, another common styling variant in it. We're doing a lateral tap here, 
Uh, you could also, again, be doing taps back as well while doing this. Works out just as easy. Yeah, so lastly, I'm gonna do is go over using a basic here compression. So once we've gone from here, back together forward, I can switch to here, switch to our side basic, switch to a closed basic. So you can see that we can use all of these movements, seamlessly transitioning, and these form our hustle foundations from which all of our other motions work. Again, it's a six count dance using a tap step, triple step, step, step. Um, guys should be moving every bit as much as the ladies for the most part. Um, we have two variants there. We did with a throw out action here. The guy can move opening out or he can stand his ground and she does the walking. I hope you enjoyed that. That's actual Latin hustle from the 70s and that's Latin hustle, not to be confused with three count or syncopated hustle of today. Thank you, I hope you enjoyed it.